and sure enough, you can actually import your Google contacts if you, if you um, use this uh, integration here built in, into Chime. But what if you Con if you're constantly working in Google Contacts, you're constantly making little changes on your phone, that's where you want a continuous two-way sync. And that's what PySync is about. Um, so let me just um, jump in the actual configuration screen of PySync so you can see what, what this is doing. It's the two arrows show what it is. It's a two-way mm -hmm. sync. You can actually make it a one-way sync if you're kind of wary of, of, of making um, unknown changes, but most people do, do set it up as a two-way sync. Mm -hmm. And you control the sync. You, it, it's not this invisible, let's hit a button and, and wait what happens. No, it's, it's up to you to say clearly, you know what, in my Google contacts, I have these and these and these contacts. In fact, I have a couple of contacts that I've given the label buyers. I may have some other contacts that I've given a label, um, let's say uh, business. Those are the contacts that I want synced with Chime. Conversely, you know what, actually I do have some contacts in Chime as well. Let's also make sure that they, they make, make their way into, into, into uh, Google Contacts.